Hi there and welcome back to Bear Spot Country Club's YouTube channel. In this video here we're going to show you how to enter scores into the Golf Canada system. First off we'll go to the internet and head to our Golf Bear Spot website. As you can see here I've already logged in or I've already gone to the Golf Bear Spot so it's www.golfbearspot.com. From there I'm going to enter my password and my username that would have been provided at the start of the season from administration. Okay, the next step we're going to make is by going to the Handicap tab here in the top. I'll select Handicap, followed by going to GolfCanada.ca. So I'll select this link right here, and this should take me directly to this page. If you want to skip this process, you're more than able to go to GolfCanada.ca directly instead of Golf Bear Spot. From there, we're going to click on the top right where it says Members Area and Score Center. So let's highlight that and select it. Okay, I'm going to put in my mock username and password. So those should be provided to you at the start of the year and should carry over from years past. If you, if you don't remember them, just contact the golf shop. We'll be able to help you at any time. So let's go in and make it and enter a score. So I've entered it in. As you can see here, I haven't had any scores put in. I have no handicap, but that doesn't stop us from being able to enter scores. So on the right hand side, we have a bunch of options in the red. We're going to select the top one and put enter score. Okay, so once this loads up, we're going to have many options. First, we can choose a total score or we can select it with hole by hole. If we select hole by hole, it'll give us every hole. This is just a tracker for how you do on average score per year on that, on that hole. We can also include statistics, which means how many greens did I hit, birdies, eagles, etc. So let's say we played yesterday, so we'll select the 16th of February at Bear Spa. We played 18 holes, we played the white tees. If we wanted to switch it, all we'd have to do is click on this drop down box and select which tees we played. So we played the whites, so we'll keep it as, as whites. We, this rating and slope has already been put in, so we don't have to worry about that. If you haven't a tester, if you've got a friend that's already been added to the system, you can add it, but it is not necessary. If you play in a league play day, or any tournament event, you must select tournament for the score type. If you're just playing for a casual round, please don't bother. We can add the score in. We'll say we shot 80, and we're going to go ahead and post score. Now, a quick setup that we might want to adjust is that if I don't play the white tees every round, and more generally we'll play the blue tees, I go up to the top right here and click My Settings. So let's select My Settings. This is where, under Default T, our fourth option down, we can choose that and make it the blues. But because we're playing the whites today, let's just keep it at whites and switch it there. So we press OK. That saves it. So back to posting score. We've put in the 80, we've put in the date, we've put in the tee box, and we've put in the amount of holes. So we're going to go ahead and post score. So as it says, the score was successfully posted. Click here to continue. Now it shows my scores that I've put in. So just the one so far. So it's an 80. Now, it won't give me a handicap, it just gives me a differential. We must have five scores put in to generate a handicap. So if you do have any more questions regarding the Golf Canada, please do not hesitate to contact the golf shop. Thanks, and have a great day.